You know, in Africa, the mental illness, it, 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 we don't take it seriously. We're sitting on a time bomb. There's not much effort to address the mind. There's a lot of stigma around mental health. One group which is more affected with depression, teenagers. I feel, I feel I'm alone, that's why I'm going to kill myself. There's a lot of treatment gaps. For this year, more than 10, the person committed suicide. In this program, Kawanje is changing the culture of the youth in Malawi because they're now opening up to, 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 to talk about depression. Kids know that if, if a celebrity is going through something like that, I can also go through that. We have been so dramatic because we have lost a lot of youth here in Malawi. Kawanje as it is have been popular. People were here to see who are the producers, you know, who, who, who are bringing these good things to us. They can make the audience to be attracted with the drama. I go to Kawanje and discuss good things with friends. I like that thing. I was surprised. The time is very short, the impact is significant. So if we have youth who are mentally disturbed, who are stressed, how do we have good leaders? This is new to me and to my students, to the whole society. I would say people have started changing and people have started looking at mental health in a different way. People are aware and if you become aware then you will want to seek help. But it is still challenging because we don't even have that capacity. After maybe five or ten years they become, they become fathers and others become mothers. So it will give chance for them to spread this education to their children.